guys and welcome back to my channel my name is nana and today i am back with the dreamer family i don't play enough with this family but i think next to the goths this is one of my least favorite households i just don't have a lot of inspiration for them at the moment darren just got done making this beautiful painting by the way i almost don't want to sell it i think it looks it's very feminine there's something so so i don't know it just reminds me of summer if that's yeah it just it reminds me of summer i think that's that's a quite a good representation of summer so darren is taking a shower he's been up painting almost the entire night he's been pretty dedicated oh my god i just noticed this i love when he just is painting he can look out through his window and there's like a tree with like a street light oh it's just something so romantic about having the oh my god i just look Oh, you guys, I'm having a weird situation going on with the ones of my sims. It seems like I have, I've taken out a mod recently and ever since doing that, it seems that my, um, my ones are a bit broken. So fortunately we're playing this blind. I have no clue what he wants. I only have one clue with um with Derek because he has one slot that actually works so we're gonna play an episode in a in a blind style that's kind of cool it's kind of kind of kind of different for ones isn't it well i have some plans for the boys so obviously both of their love lives are not going really great and i think that's very kind of me to say like this it's it's pretty bad <laughs> Darren has still a big, big, big love interest for Cassandra. And as much as I want him to get with either Cassandra or Brandy, I realize that Darren is aging up in about nine days and he's going to be an elder. And I remember from my goth let's play that Cassandra is actually also a bit older. Brandy is on the younger side, probably because she's been pregnant quite a few times, but if we take that out of the equation she is younger and she wants more children and i'm afraid that darren is going to continue aging by the time that brandy has her children before there were other concerns that i had i definitely just didn't think they were compatible but now with the age i i really just feel like he and cassandra will be fine i mean maybe they can have one kid together and maybe they're just even gonna have one kid you know maybe they're not gonna have a, another kid at all i just don't really know if he would like another child but he doesn't have a family wish either way um so i don't really i guess i just don't really mind i don't know i um i think it's this is the way it's supposed to be he's just gonna get with cassandra and since brandy is out of the picture me still loves her but since she is since she is since she is out of the picture what i'm going to do is just focus entirely on his relationship with cassandra and see if we can get that you know get that done so dear care also has some relationship problems it looks like his ones have reset which is perfect not sure there's bugs bugs everywhere am i did my cat just fart? I think my cat just farted on me. Excuse me. Excuse me. I remember what his interest is. It might be gaming, but let me go over here, do Derek, and then show me the one hobby. It's actually tinkering, which mm, I'm not sure, but I'm actually going to make it games. I think games would be nice because he also has, he already has four points in games. So I'm just going to make it games, okay? <laughs> just gonna do it like that i'm hoping that once Darren wakes up his wants have been reset as well i'm not really sure what's going on but i shouldn't be too long now as you guys know his relationship with lilith has ended and his relationship with angela has ended and he's actually really really mad at her angela broke up with him just a few days ago oh my god and it looks like she spread her um <laughs> she spread the pimples it's agony for everyone <laughs> He he was very confused at first because she broke up with him. And obviously she asked, you know, like, oh, he asked, she, he asked, you know, like, what's going on? Like, why are we breaking up? Like, you just convinced me to, you know, to date you and to leave a little for you. And now you're telling me you want to break up. It's only been like a, a few weeks and 
Lilith is like, yeah, well, you know, you kind of did that by yourself and I just, I just don't really like you that much. I just wanted to see if you would fall for it and honestly, you just did. So he's really, really, really upset. And during this whole time, he's been just thinking and thinking and thinking and sulking about his loss. The relationship he had with Lilith is probably the biggest loss he's had in his life. Now, he doesn't have many friends, so he's not very social. And I wonder if that is in his personality. Just let me just... Yeah, he's very shy. So he's not a person that goes up to people very, very often. He doesn't make a lot of friends. He just likes being, I guess, more by himself. I mean, I don't necessarily think he wants to be by himself. But when you're shy, it's just harder to make many friends. And he just... He has a love letter! Oh my gosh, he has a love letter, you guys. Oh my god, I have never... Have you ever seen this? Oh my god, I need to take a picture of this. Have you guys ever had a love letter before? I wonder who it's from. Oh no, oh please tell me we're gonna read it. We're not reading it? Oh no, 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 disappointment. Thanks for the fun note. I had fun. I hope you know that dating you was good. And if you wonder, should I ask again? I say you. <gasps> oh, 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 oh my. Guys, let's read this carefully again. I had fun. I hope you know that dating you was good. And if you wonder, should I ask again? I say you should over ever in her entire life sent him a love letter after dumping him i didn't even know lilith had such a side to her but oh my god it makes all the damn sense do you guys remember when lilith was really into becoming a writer and um she wants to become i think she wants to become a journalist so she has like her little notebook where she writes and writes and writes obviously she's been thinking about dirt but you know she just figured it was done and over with like she doesn't really know the relationship anymore um, between her sister and Dirk because she doesn't really talk to any of the two. You know, Angela made sure that that, that didn't happen anymore the second they got together. I mean, it's not even like Dirk didn't even come to tell her in person that they broke up. It was just like her sister just told her, hey, look, we're dating now. So that's the situation. And I am just, I am just flabbergasted. I never thought that Lilith would, you know, take such a ballsy ballsy step but it also makes sense because he's very shy so maybe she knew that she needed to do something in order to make him understand but also not you know force herself upon her but also i feel like lilith was really trying to win him back i really think their relationship was really good and very deep and very like very powerful a really strong really strong bond with a lot of trust and love and and shit I always need to add something stupid at the end, don't I? It's the sweetest thing. I need to... We have some money left. So what I'm going to do is get a bed. I don't I don't really like this color of this bed, actually. So we're just going to... Okay, whatever. <laughs> and I'm going to place this letter. Oh my god, it has a picture on it as well. Wait, 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 wait. Oh my god, you guys. We got a love letter. Oh, wait, wait, wait. It doesn't actually... It would be funny if it actually had a picture. Wait. Wait, what? What? Oh my god, I am so confused. I thought Lilith... I honestly thought Lilith sent him the sweetest note ever. But it looks like Cassandra has sent him... Oh, oh my god. Wait, 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 wait. Wait. Oh, oh, I misunderstood the entire situation now, you guys. This wasn't meant for Derek. He just thought it was so sweet, but it wasn't meant for him. It was from, it was for Darren. I was, yo, I was, I was over here drooling by myself, just thinking, oh, that's so sweet. And then it turns out that it wasn't for, it wasn't, it wasn't there. Oh, well, I'm very happy for Darren. Darren, this is, this is your chance, son. This is your chance to make something. I wonder what he thinks of this. Let's view this. I wonder what happens if we actually view it. It doesn't look like Oliver wants work yet, but one is enough. One is enough. Let's see what he thinks about that. Oh, it was for Darren. Oh, I was so I was so concerned for, for a second that she had a thing for Derek. I'm like, Cassandra, 
really dear darren i had fun love cassandra Cassand don't do i need to remind all of you that cassandra is married at this moment yet she 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 uh she i i told you guys if you've been following my goth let's play i told you guys the second that cassandra has her children she's done with the with the marriage it wasn't gonna last anyway but but cassandra really wanted the children and dawn was also really happy with the children so i guess it was just a mutual agreement to have children and then just you know end the relationship but officially they're still together so technically technically te technically it's almost like cheating i guess but not really oh uh, we are going to ask her on a date i don't give one damn at this point you guys i'm gonna give her oh don't put oh don't leave that in the microwave oh oh darren please don't things are gonna explode if you keep them too long in the microwave <laughs> I'm I'm so happy, but I also feel kind of bad for Dirk now. He was so he was he was, he was super 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 excited, and now he's just disappointed because obviously his date with Cassandra uh, with Lilith is not going to happen. But I think you know I he really misses Lilith, and if Lilith had in fact sent that letter, I was still going to make them go on a date. So I'm still gonna follow through with my plan, but instead I'm going to just have him put on the you know the shoes, the big shoes. Let's see if Lilith feels the same way. He feels really really terrible about everything that happened, and he honestly misses her misses her so so much. I think he would never let her go if they ever got back together because they love each other so incredibly much. And it was also a good memory. Look, he's really really happy that he broke up with her, but he was devastated that he broke up with Lilith. It's honestly it just it just pains me so much. All right. Let's see what her answer is. Either she's really upset and she's going to say no. <gasps> No, I don't think so. I'm super sorry, Dirk. I'm super sorry for you being rejected, but it 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 was going to happen. You you know you really broke her heart, and she's in a really good place. I hope for you guys to eventually. I hope yeah, I, I really hope eventually you guys can come together and have um a relationship together, but it. It may not happen. So Darren is actually asked his dad to come with him. And even though Darren has some plans to ask Cassandra on a date later today, he really wanted to go out and be amongst people. He was really feeling a bit lonely, actually. So he's asked his dad to come with him. And together, I think they're going to go to the community, a community lot, maybe a pool. I know it's a bit cold for a pool, but let's just pretend the pool's like heated. And I think that will be really nice. Um, yeah, let's just go to the pool and I'll meet you guys there. So I feel it's been a long time since they've- Oh, and his wands are fixed. Perfect. Okay, so I don't actually have to take anything out. I was super worried because I took out some 18 plus mods that I just reviewed for a haul. And for them to just cause this wand bug would be really weird. So I'm really happy that, yeah, they're- they're- What is this? They're literally from the same genetic pool. Like, they're staring at a sink like they don't even know what this is. Guys, this is what you use after peeing. You know, you- you know, you shake your willy and then you wash your hands, okay? You really could use some time away from home. <gasps> oh my god. It's Angela. I really don't want him to meet Angela. He's completely over Angela. I don't think anything good is going to happen from meeting Angela. I was secretly on the inside hoping that we would see... Hopefully we would see... <gasps> Oh, don't look. Don't look. Oh, no. She's coming over. Oh, no. She's coming over. Why? What does she want from... What does she want from Darren? What does she want from him? Be greeted. Oh, my God. Is she literally gonna be... Oh, are you really, are you really going to be like this? Are you really going to be like this? Oh, that looks... She ran away. Whoa. I just had a thought where I was like, maybe we should have Derek get a friend whoa he looks cute girl i'm not surprised that angela is over here just making more friends because i'm just going to be honest with you guys i angela is 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 quite all over the place let's be honest you know oh i really wanted to be friends with him i guess it's not gonna happen he just left us okay maybe our dad 
Um, let's just talk to our dad for a little bit. Our social needs are super low. We're feeling really lonely and I love how there's a ginormous Sims 2 sign just, just right over there. Just like, yeah, no, no, nothing weird about that. So I, I think we're just having, um, you know, a father-son moment here and just kind of talking about the things that are happening. It's kind of hard to talk about Angela when she's right behind you, but... Great, there's two women here that are both like disgusted by us. So what is what is going on today? We're we're two fine chocolate boys. Darren, you're still a boy to me too, don't you worry. You're not oh, Cassandra is f Oh, Cassandra's here! Oh, oh my, what a coincidence. I really wanted to go out with her tonight, but it looks like she actually What happened? Was she mean? I think she was mean to him. She got insulted? What is up? What is up with everyone today? What is up with everyone today? Oh my god, I'm just gonna greet Cassandra. I have to go, but I wanna greet her. I wanna see how he's going to greet her. I, I wanna see. I wanna see how this man greets his his, his girl. He's like oh my god, he just literally just just smooches her right there and right then he's like you me tonight we have a date set okay come to the bistro i'll be waiting for you need to dress fancy we're not gonna keep our clothes on tonight anyway would you love the confidence that darren had to just smooch her right there and right then after receiving that love letter oh my god it gave him all the confidence he needed to know he wants to go oh he wants to go on a date oh and i'm going to get I am. I, I am. I, I will make it happen, you guys. Watch me. <laughs> Watch me. You know, I really do feel a little bad. Derek is trying his hardest to, you know, to, to get the relationship back. But I have to understand that Lilith is a little hesitant because of everything that's happened. And, you know, maybe you guys should just let it be. And as, as much as it hurts for Derek because he really, really, really do loves her and he... You know, he really wants her back. I think Lilith at this time and this place is just in such a good position, like a, such a good stage in her life, like a place in her life with everything is just looking good in her life. And she's just away from all the drama. And as much as she does still have feelings for Dirk, I just don't think she will allow him back in her life for more than friends. So as much as he wants to go on a date with her, as much as he wants to do all these things with her, we're just going to order some pizza, have some time by ourselves, and just 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 know that we're working on a friendship, and that's just all there is in it for us at the moment. That's all we're gonna get, just friends. Now I just realized that he has about seven days until he turns into a teenager. I don't quite remember if he was supposed to be older or younger than them, but I guess it doesn't really matter. I just play a lot more with the. Um, with the Pleasant Twins that I have with Dirk and I have played more with Dustin but Dustin was definitely older than the rest so I think once the teenagers once the twins go to college because I'm going, I'm, I'm going to try to get them all to college and then we'll have Dustin, Dirk, the twins and eventually of course we'll probably have Lucy joining and Alexander I think these two might be joining the first semester when Dustin leaves his first. It leaves after his last semester. I think that's. I think that's how the age. Um, the age difference. How big the age difference is. Or the age gaps. But he's gonna join college the same time as Angela and as Layla. So it'll be perfect. And I already enrolled Dustin in college, so he's going to be like an entire semester ahead of the girls, or even just half. I think half actually it may just be half because they were close in age okay so i think dustin will be half a semester ahead of the girls and Derek, of course and then once they're all in their third semester then we'll probably enroll alexander and lucy and if there's any other, you know, any other teenagers that I've forgotten in this world, I would definitely am, you know. I th oh, of course. I think by then we might have the rest, the other um, Bo and... Okay, well, whatever. I'm just, I'm just looking far ahead right now, but... 
Oh, it's a penguin. It's so cute. I'm I'm definitely looking probably too far ahead, but that's kind of what I want. I I think I'll get them all to the point of college and then kind of play with them and then I'll try to record some parts where like everyone is involved. Um I'll try to do like that. It probably makes no sense right now, but once it happens, it'll be it'll make all the sense in the world. Don't don't, don't you worry about it. All right. So Derek is going to have a great time by himself sitting underneath the phone hoping desperately hoping and wishing that Lil is gonna call him eating his na eating his pizza and now uh, we're gonna get ready for a date it's our infamous <laughs> infamous diner it's um it's my favorite place wait 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 wait, wait. form is there no influence to form gesture form there's no form ask oh wait 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 ask to form on date are we aren't we on a date no i think we do we not ask her on a date okay well now we now we're on a date never mind i think it was weird but let's be seated then <laughs> okay so he wants to definitely entertain her so let's start out with a dirty joke i'm hoping we can joke while we're sitting there we actually might not but let's start out with a toast to a beautiful lady i i'm why and there's a random want about derek as well I'm, I'm, I'm. <laughs> can we play as well let's flirt a little bit i guys i'm having a time in my life okay so i'm gonna order the chef's choice i'm gonna see what he thinks i am into besides beautiful women oh she is so oh i um mm, i'm so happy for them i am so 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 happy and cassandra is so cute oh my god i love her i love her so much i'm really happy for them to finally be able to you know to spend time like this but i'm also kind of worried because I am just imagining Dawn to come in here anytime. It's going to cause some drama. So what did he order? I don't really know what that is. But he ordered pancakes? Is that dessert? It looks like he ordered a dessert. And she has a piece of tuna or salmon. Obviously more expensive probably. Because, you know, living that lavish life. Ooh. Oh, oh, there it comes. There, there it comes, you guys. Okay, get get your get your butt off. We need to start making some moves now. We're gonna start busting some moves and see if she wants to come home with us. Have a good time. Maybe we can make out. We can definitely make out in there. I don't know if Cassandra is the type, but I'm definitely the type. So Cassandra is the type. Mm -mm. Now, which is interesting is that when we go to appreciate, there is a option to apologize. Oh, it's Brandy. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh, we are just smooching another lady and Brandy is right there. But Brandy doesn't seem bothered at all, actually. Brandy seems to be very, very okay with it. I don't know what could have possibly upset her, but he is he's really apologizing his heart out. Now, I know there was something here. It's no longer here. I'm so disappointed. There was a um, a photo booth. We could totally woohoo in there, but it's, it's gone for some reason. So now we can't do it. All right, so let's get some of these, um, these ones up. So he wants to woohoo. He wants to flirt with her. I'm... You guys, I am really surprised, but I think whatever I said, you know, has definitely shown its true colors. Brandy was literally, she came in here, she saw them together, she stood in front of them, she's definitely seen them. And you know what? She wasn't jealous, she actually didn't care at all. She was just very, like, her happy self, she was just smiling. Your sim wants to continue the date in the comfort of their own home. To ask a date back to your place, click on the sim and choose ask back to my place. Okay. Okay, so how about we make out a little bit and then we're going to ask her to let's go back to my place. Ooh, super happy. Okay. Do you want to come back to my place, Cassandra? I have a really big bed. My house is not... Oh, he wants to marry her as well. Oh, wait. So my house is definitely not as good as your house and I don't have a lot of money. But you know you can you can don't that's okay, creepy. But uh my my my, my bed works, okay? We're gonna rock my bed of <laughs> Oh 
boy. She has, she wants a classic dance. She wants to get a bag rub from him. You know, it's very specific. I think she's going to the bathroom first. She's just going to powder her nose. He's like, I'm going to congratulate her on wanting to go back home with me. This means, means, means the entire world. All right, so let's see if there's anything. Oh, she does want to have a woohoo. Ooh. You want, don't you dare sleep. Propose. Oh my god, am I gonna ask her to stay the night? Am I gonna be? No, I can't be doing that. I can't be doing that. But how oh, much I want to have a woohoo. I hope Dirk is not in the bed right now. That would. Dirk, <laughs> Dirk, get out of the bed. Sleep in your own bed. Dirk devoured the pizza and he was like, I am. I, 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 I. Do you remember if they've had their first woohoo yet? But, um, I guess you guys are gonna find out really, really... Yo, wait, hold up. Cassandra? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Would you like to, to, to join me on the bed? <laughs> I think she wanted to um, make sure. I love how he's sleeping with her face next to her on a card. But you know what this means? She sent this card to to you know to um to Darren before I gave her the makeover. That's why she still looks the same. It's kind of funny. Anyway, I'm having I'm having way too much fun with this. All right, are you ready, you guys? Should we ease into it or just go for the big guns? Okay, so let's. Okay, let's first do a kiss, then make out, then woohoo. Let's ease into it. Just get a couple points. Just, just do a few things. Oh, they're so good. I'm definitely not going to use this as a... Um, oh my god. I'm having to blur this entire thing. I don't have 18 plus mods, but all of a sudden my sins get naked. No. No. Why did you have to get Nikki? Oh, they're like, and mm, 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 mm. please put some. Oh, thank the Lord, thank the Lord for, for things like this. Okay, let's get up. She wants to do something. Okay, she still wants to make out some more. I. Let's just end the date here. I think, end the date. Okay. Wow, that was about the best time I've ever had with anybody i really want to go out with you again please oh please oh please okay maybe i'm exaggerating too much but that's how i imagine please put some clothes on darren oh that's so nice and now he's gonna come downstairs have some pizza and eat together with his son just talking hey guys about this was a successful day at least for one of the two dreamers but um darren could not be more happy he's super super happy he's over the moon actually and um, he's just really, I, they're not talking. They're just sitting together eating pizza in pure silence. They're not even watching the TV, honestly. They're just having a moment together, appreciating what has happened. You know when something has happened and you both know, you know, you, just don't even, you don't even need to talk. You just sit there and you agree with the situation. You just let the situation be. This is the perfect time for me to end it, you guys. I want to thank you guys so, so, so much for watching. And I'll see you guys in my next part. Bye.